All right, what's going on guys? Today, we're gonna have a very educational video. We're gonna be taking a look at this gender master list that I found on Tumblr. It's basically a complete list of all of the genders in the world. There are over 100 different genders on this list, okay? Now, obviously, we're not gonna look at every single one of them or we're gonna be here forever looking at them. I will link the full list in the description description down below if you want to go check it out for yourself you know educate yourself on some of these different genders but I figured we could use today as a learning experience okay we need to learn all of these new genders all right because I certainly was not aware of these I, I didn't know that all of these existed okay I thought there was only two genders male and and female that's what i was told actually ironically male and female are not even on this list i went down the list and i looked at all of them and male and female are not even included on this comprehensive list of genders they got a hundred fucking other ones on there all sorts of stuff but they don't have male or female this isn't adding up. I don't know how reliable this source is. Maybe, you know, we need to get a bio major up in here to clarify or something. I'm clearly not educated or qualified to know what's going on here, but regardless, you know, let's go ahead and educate ourselves together, okay? So let's go ahead and take a look at some of these. They are in alphabetical order, so I'm just gonna go down the list, maybe point out a few that I thought were particularly interesting, and we'll go from there, I guess. So let's go ahead and start. First, we have this one right here, which I was a little bit confused about. I believe it's pronounced Adamus gender. I don't know, I see the word Adam in there, and then there's an AS, Adamus gender. It says, a gender which refuses to be categorized. Now, I didn't quite understand this because if they're refusing to be categorized, aren't you categorizing them by calling them a Adamus gender? Like, wouldn't that be their category? They fit in this Adamus category. So I was really confused here because you're categorizing people who apparently refuse to be categorized. This ain't adding up. That's all I'm saying, y'all. You might want to look over your list again and make sure everything's adding up. Next, we have Aerogender, a gender that is influenced by your surroundings. Now, this one was also interesting to me. So does that mean like if you're in a forest that you're a forest gender? Or like, well, I'm so confused here. Or like if you're in a desert, you got a desert gender. Am I misunderstanding this? Because it says it's influenced by your surroundings. Maybe it's like if you're around all females, you're now a female. And if you're around males, you're a male because, you you know, you're influenced by them. I don't I don't quite understand how this works. I need some clarification on some of these because I'm just not educated enough on uh, genders, I guess, because this doesn't make any sense to me. Next, we have Alexi gender, a gender that is fluid between more than one gender, but the individual cannot tell what those genders are. All right, let me make sure I got this right. Okay, so you're apparently just all sorts of different genders, but you just don't know which one you are, but you know that you're you're just a whole bunch of them. Like, what? You know what? It's already like four minutes into this video and we're still on the A's. This might have to be a part one we might have to make a series out of this i don't know because there's way too many on here that i want to look at and you know there's not enough time in one video to put them all in all right here's the next one amari gender a gender that changes depending on who you're in love with uh so i think this one is like if you're in love with a male you then become a female or oh, well actually i guess you could still be a male you know nothing wrong with the homosexuals out there you know what i'm saying shout out to jarl but I'm assuming that like, if you're in love with a female that likes males, okay, yeah, then you would be a male, or maybe if you're in love with a male that likes females, you would then turn into a female to uh, match up with whoever you're in love with. I think that's how this is supposed to work, I don't know. All right, next we have ambigender, defined as having the feeling of two genders simultaneously without fluctuation, meant to reflect the concept of being ambidextrous only with gender. Okay, so you know how everyone's usually either right-handed or left-handed, right? But there are some people who are ambidextrous. That means they can use their right hand and left hand equally. So this is basically the gender version of that. So basically, if, if I'm understanding this correctly, you're allowed to be a male 
and a female at the same time and you're like equally good at both like i might have to do some investigating on this one you know this sounds like a good deal you know i might have to check this out all right hold on everyone get your calculators out for this one this is not adding up i'm not even sure how to pronounce this ambanek it doesn't even have gender. It does it not have to have gender in the word. I don't know. I think that's Ambonek or Ambonek. I don't know. Anyways, it says identifying as both man and woman, yet neither at the same time. Is this adding up? You know what? Maybe my calculator is broken, but this ain't fucking adding up. How do you identify as a man and a woman, yet at the same time, you don't identify as a man and a woman what how does this make sense i think these people got to be trolling with some of these some of these are just ridiculous this doesn't even make sense i don't know man that one just is not making sense let's see what the next one is okay amica gender a gender that changes depending on which friend you're with listen here man i'm tired of these genders that are changing based on who you're talking to or who you're hanging out with or your surroundings or all that you can't be letting the world influence you all right deep down in your heart you know what gender you are, all right? So you need to stick to that. Don't let other people influence your gender, okay? But I guess this is, uh, like, if you're hanging out with dudes, you're a dude. You know, you want to be one of the guys or whatever. And you want to go have a girl's night, I guess, when you're hanging out with girls and, you know, you become a girl. I don't I don't quite understand. Maybe, maybe I'm completely wrong about all of these that I've talked about. I just literally, this is like, as someone who knows nothing about all this uh, gender stuff, this is just the way... I I'm interpreting it because I literally know absolutely nothing about I'm not trying to roast all y'all all right before you tumblr people get sad or whatever hey he's roasting our gender I'm, I'm really not roasting you I'm just I'm trying to understand you know I think eventually one day we might have to memorize all of these you know because I'm gonna be walking around and people are gonna be telling me that they're a fucking Ambonek, and I'm gonna need to know what that means. You know what I mean? I can't just be like, hey, what the fuck is that? You know, I gotta educate myself for when the time comes when people start telling me they're one of these things. So, you know, I'm just trying to get a lesson here, you know, just some educational content. All right, here's the next one. This one wasn't really making sense to me either. Aneasy gender? Aneasy gender? I don't know how to even pronounce half of these, man. But, anyways, feeling like a certain gender yet being more comfortable identifying with another. This doesn't make sense to me. If you're more comfortable, Comfortable identifying as another gender why wouldn't you just identify as that one like why are you doing I, this isn't making sense man listen let me talk to the fucking gender president or whoever the fuck came up with this list because some of these are really not making sense to me you need to either update these definitions to where they make sense or maybe some of these are wrong i don't know because some of these they just seem like this this can't happen all right, the next one is a non-gender, a gender that is unknown to both yourself and others. At least this one makes sense, man. A non-anonymous, you know, anonymous gender, a gender that is unknown. Okay, this one at least makes sense. I like this one, all right? This is a good one. Maybe one day the scientists out there can do some more gender research and there won't be a non-gender anymore because we'll have a name for it. But for now, you know, you'll be a, a non-gender. I don't even know how to fucking say this uh app consu gender i i'm sorry man no offense to all the app consu genders out there i just i don't know how to fucking say that so anyways a gender where you know what it isn't but not what it is the gender is hiding itself from you now hold on this wasn't making sense because if you know what something isn't then by the process of fucking narrowing it down right you know that something's not let's just use something simple here colors okay if you know something's not red blue green or purple then it's probably fucking yellow right like you can kind of narrow it down obviously there's more fucking colors than that you know what i'm saying but if you know what it isn't wouldn't you be able to narrow it down and figure out what it actually is so i'm very confused here okay i need some help can a gender expert please help me understand these because i really don't understand all right i think we're gonna do one final one this is gonna finish off the a's it literally took me like 10 minutes just to get through the A's. I don't know why. I guess A has like the majority of the definitions. But here's the last one. They put a uh, possible trigger warning before you read it, which I thought was pretty funny. But it says, uh, 
Auti gender, a gender that can only be understood in the context of being autistic? What the fuck kind of shit is this? I think what this is saying is that only autistic people can understand this gender. I don't even understand that. That's that's kind of weird. I don't know. I feel like that's kind of disrespectful, is it not? I don't. Maybe that's why they put the trigger warning on it. I, and I personally, I'm not really going to get triggered, but I feel like some people seeing that would legitimately get upset. But anyways, that is pretty much it for the A's. There's like three more A's, but it took me like 10 minutes to get through the A's. So I'll tell you what, if you want me to do a part two where I go through some of the rest of these, you know, there's like 80 more. There was only like 20 in the A's. I did like half of them, probably not even half, probably did less than half. There's probably like 25, 30 A's and I did like, I don't know, like 10. But if you guys want a part two, let me know and we can continue this. If not, you're free to go check out the list on your own, see what they have to offer. Lots of uh, interesting genders going on there. But anyways, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. What is your favorite gender that we discovered today? You know, lots of educational stuff. Other than that, thank you guys all for watching. Be sure to leave a like rating if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're not already. Follow me on Twitter. Links in the description down below. Other than that, have a good day and peace out.